happy start of the week. Good morning. I hope you're watching this as you are getting ready for your day or maybe you're taking a quick break throughout your day and are watching this video. I love hearing your comments. I love seeing your likes and your thumbs up. Thank you for sharing the video with your friends and colleagues. That means a lot to me. I've been thinking about this phrase that I hear um, and I say um, because I believe in it. I believe this phrase is accurate and true. It's a phrase that evokes a lot of hope and a lot of action in my life. I use this phrase to empower other people, my clients, friends, colleagues, you, to keep going. And the phrase is, we are going to make it. We're going to be okay. The phrase doesn't mean that what we're going through right now is easy, um, insignificant, um, we shouldn't make such a big deal about it, or that it's not a real thing. It doesn't mean any of those things. The phrase we are going to make it deeply acknowledges the space we are in. It's about really being clear and honest and vulnerable and aligned with what is going on right now. Whether what is going on for you is public thing, right? Something that many people can relate to and are going through with you, or whether it's a private thing, something that you are holding very close to your heart um, and are not sharing with a lot of people the details or the, the reasons for what it is that you're going through privately. We are going to make it because we acknowledge where we are. We acknowledge what happened. I think the other reason why I like saying we're going to make it is because when we say we're going to make it, I'm going to make it, we're going to have to also look at what do we need. Not just be vulnerable with where we're at and what that looks like, but also what do we need. So acknowledging and then asking, asking for help, asking for breath, asking for Maybe it's asking for something that you you need for yourself and your family. Maybe it's asking for some support, for time. I think the power of asking is it's like a, a whispered prayer, right? We say what we need. And there's a lot of humility that is required in honestly and earnestly asking for what it is we need. So we acknowledge and we ask. And this is why we say we're going to make it. I'm going to make it. And the last thing that I think about when I think of we're going to make it is to affirm, right? So affirming to me means that I, I speak the truth. I have a dear friend who many years ago when I was really in a, in a part of my life where a lot of the things that I was going through uh, were private. She encouraged me to think on what is true. Speaking the truth over your life, over the circumstances, over the people that are around you, uh, whether that's friends and family, the situation, speaking truth. Um, so I like to think about truth as immovable. Right? I think a lot of times people say, this is my truth. There are foundational truths, like um, you are worthy to be loved. You are worthy to be appreciated. You are worthy of doing good work. You are worthy of having good relationships. You are worthy of knowing that you are not doomed to live in these circumstances and in these things that are happening in your life, whether they're personal, private, or public. Um, pain has a way of coming in and crashing in and, and creating a crater. And sometimes it's a, it's a small crater and sometimes it's a really large crater. I don't think that we are meant to move into those craters. I think we are meant to make it through. We're going to be okay. You're going to be okay. Acknowledge where you are. Acknowledge what is happening in your life. Acknowledge and be vulnerable with uh, what it is you need. Ask for help. 
ask for the things that you need, whether it's personal or professional or in the moment, right? Just right now, you may need a break, just a tiny break, just like five minutes to yourself. You may need to call a friend uh, who tells you that um, you're going to be okay. And then affirm the truth speak truth over your life, get really grounded on the things that are unshakably, undeniably, unmovably true about you, your character, your inner strength, your beauty, your purpose. Get really, really clear to affirm truth about yourself and your life. So this is why I say we're going to make it. I'm going to make it because even if in the moment it feels like there's a crater and I have been knocked into that crater, I can still be vulnerable and acknowledge where I am, acknowledge how I got here, if I know how I got here, ask for the things that I need and affirm the truth about myself and my life. I hope this is helpful to you because I know there are so many of us who are going through so many things that we didn't plan for, we did not know, uh, we didn't get an announcement for uh, the things that we're going through, um, and and we, we may feel ill-prepared for it. It may not be okay right now, but we're going to make it, and it's going to be okay. Thank you for listening.